Men as come. Men as come, Abby. Bye bye. I lose company. Okay, this one you must be interested. So don't swipe. Come closer. Yes, today we are going to look at a very popular phrase that is common among the other gender. So who is the other gender? Allah knows. But as far as I am concerned, we have just two genders, male and female. Any other kind of gender apart from that one are people who are not really alright. That's by the way. Now to the bone of contention. I know that it is common from that other gender to always say a phrase like men are scum. So men has come. But are men scum? Men has come, Abby. Men has come. No, ah, no problem. No problem. Babe, Babe, your father, Alus Comni. Your brother, Alus Comni. Your son, Alus Comni. Whether you like it or not. If you are one of those that used to generalize with those people that don't really have sense that men are scum. I know that some people, some men actually do behave like scum. You are going to get there. But making it a general statement without considering that it was a scum that scummed you to the world as well. Is something that is very, very stupid. Men are not scum. I'm not disputing the fact that we don't have men who behave like scum. I'm not disputing that fact. But you cannot generalize that statement for any reason whatsoever. Now that being said, you know this thing, this scum of a thing is two sides of a coin. As we have people who are not alright in our own side, we also have people who are not alright in your side of that gender too. Whether you like it or not, you can argue with your keypad. Don't abuse me. Oh. I'm not a foul. Don't abuse me. If you abuse me, I'll abuse you back. Don't abuse me. What I'm saying is my own opinion, which is subjected to being rejected, which is also subjected to refutation. So, where do I agree with you that men has come? Yes, I have a point where I agree with you that some men has come. And these are the kind of men, according to my opinion, that has come. Men who are violent with their spouse. Come on. I don't understand. You profess love to a woman. And yet you have the audacity to eat her, to banter her on her face, to batter her body, to beat her, to put her into pains. Those men that are violent with their women, they are total scum. I mean, women are meant to be treated like something fragile. With care, with love, with understanding. You know, only one <laughs> That's not a joke. That's actually true. Women are meant to be treated with love, care, understanding, affection. You know they're a fragile being, so you have to be very careful while dealing with them. So I don't see any reason why any reasonable man will get to the point of reason that is reasonable for him to eat a woman, to hurt a woman violently with a reason or without a reason. Could make sense, Mr. You are Halus come. Swipe. Another series of alus come are men who are intentionally irresponsible for crying out loud. You married a woman, you with her, then you have series of offspring, and you don't know that it is your responsibility to take care of them. Ha! Agbakan, Agbakan, oh, Agbakan, Agbakan, Agbakan. You know, some women are actually going through a lot because I still used to fathom how it is possible for a man to just abandon his family and leave them to cater for themselves. Then you come back after donkey years. You see those kind of irresponsible men who don't take care of their women, who don't take care of their children, who do not take care of those who are under their care. That is another perfect example of Haluscom. Another perfect example of Haluscom are men who argue, fight with women indiscriminately hey ah 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 i say 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 exchange words violently verbally with a woman for me oh is a pointer that your IQ is low no matter what the woman must have done no matter how much she tried to infuriate you what is with keeping quiet smiling and walking away what's with that 
she's abusing you and are you the first person they will abuse in the world okay after abusing you the, the abuse is it going to come on your body forever you will leave her alone to be making new sounds of herself now and after the end of the day when people ask her taliban baja who are you fighting with who are you arguing with and they can't see anybody with her what is it going to resort to is it not you telling them that this person is tell barring yourself in you i know some of your family members will not want to tell you that i am telling you this on their behalf you are hallows come any lack are you you're arguing with a woman publicly violently then another category of hallows come that we have you are with your wife both of you are lying down on the bed your wife is fast asleep now you now carry phone you are now entering dms of other women married unmarried single divorced widowed you are now flirting with them unnecessarily she you think you need anyone to tell you that you are not alright? okay okay this part this part this part let's be clear on it let's be clear on it if you are a muslim man i'm not talking about those one that say they want to do for better for us so those one i'm not talking about those people i'm talking about muslim men this time now we are muslim man you know it is one two three four uh -huh. if you don't get it forget about it it might be that you are trying to you know fill in the slots so that is quite understandable so for single women for divorced women for widowed women we can excuse you but for married women you're not asking a married woman how was a night how was a day how is this how is that to the point that you don't know that the person you are chatting with even knows you personally then the person now asked you that are you married you said no but you have wife and kids now you said no you don't have anything you are single until the person started mentioning the name of your wife the name of your children you now say eh, you are sorry she, can you see that you are you are a perfect alus come now so going back to the main point that led to all of this, men has come, men has come, men has come. It's not as if women are not also scum. As a matter of fact, the level of your scum is more than the level of a man's scum. You cannot just make a generalized statement about men being bad. As you have good men, we have good women. And as you have bad men, we have bad women. It's, as I said earlier, it is two sides of a coin. So having said everything I've said, and if you still keep on holding to that general statement that men are scum and it means your father is allo scum your brother is allo scum and when you eventually start giving birth your sons they are also going to be a member of allo scum till then remember the name is wono touch aka sogir aka alaji swipe i am a cinematographer a multimedia enthusiast a sound engineer an acapella producer i am everything that you can find in the field of multimedia my name is Adiro Kwikma, a student of Golden Valley College, an institution with a serene environment where morals, values, and Islamic education have been integrated into academic curriculum for the betterment of the future leaders. So if you have any need of a multimedia service, don't forget to reach out to me and we promise, inshallah, to deliver to you top-notch quality service delivery. Until we meet again some other time, I say, Assalamu Alaikum.